From you wake up every morning, you's a winner, yeah. What going on, guys? It's your girl, Reza, in the brr d d Dang, we have not been in the building for a very long time, but we here now. What products do you really use on your hair, Reza? For real, for real. So today, I'm going to film my favorite products. Is it for 2019 or just these products I've been running to a lot lately? I mean, there's some products that I used in the beginning of the year that I did not repurchase because I have so many other products to try. But these products have been loyal, faithful, magnificent, extraordinary. I've been reaching for these a lot. So what does my favorite products mean to me? This is my good side. So this is what y'all gonna get today. <laughs> These are products that would be my first choice if I'm not trying out new products and doing reviews for different brands. If we're stuck on an island, we're bringing these products right here. These are products that I would repurchase with my own coins. <laughs> these are products that I would and will, would, will recommend to everyone that's why we're talking about them in this video today these are products that get me excited to do my hair and when all is said and done these are products that are just a bomb i don't know about you if you've tried them before but these are products that are bomb for me first thing first we're going to start with shampoos i don't know if i told you guys this before but lately recently just pick a struggle shampoos have been my favorite type of products i've been loving shampoos i've been loving trying new shampoos as the purpose of a shampoo is to clean your hair well i guess i like my hair being clean and i like that experience so the first shampoo up and ready to go is miel organics pure simple natural babasu conditioning shampoo by miel organics i think i said that before okay, for dry and curly hair types sulfate free and color free Wait, sulfate free and color safe. This shampoo, where do I even start? I've been using this a lot lately because it's super, super moisturizing. I don't know what ingredient sis puts in hair. The experience I get from using this is just amazing. I reach for it a lot. Sometimes I don't care to try any other shampoos ever because this is just so bomb. But I can talk about this all day, but we're gonna talk about the rest, right? This? Y'all need to try it. For real, for real, for real. The next shampoo on the list is Carol's Daughter Cocoa Cream Curl Quenching Shampoo for very dry, curly to coily hair. No sulfates, parabens, and artificial colors. Let's talk about this. <laughs> this actually has in silicones. Wait, before I checked the ingredients list, I tried this and I was just so astonished. I kind of feel the same about this, the way I feel about the previous shampoo I just mentioned. But I just hate the fact that it had to have in silicone. Like, who puts silicone in a shampoo and for what? Why would you do that? Besides that, like, this is bomb. Who told me to look at the ingredients list? It's almost finished actually. It's like right here. But let me double check because I can be here talking, talking, talking and it might not have. But I think I, yes, dimeticone. But honestly, after I saw that this had in silicone and I realized how good it was for my hair, do the ingredients even matter anymore? Let me be great. Mind your business. Use what you want to use on your hair. But I'm here to tell you that this right here is Bomb AF if you're looking for another moisturizing shampoo. Thank you. You guys remember that haul I did way back? It's probably two years ago now. I'm not sure. I did a huge haul on products from Cultural Solutions, Yadin Roots. The reason that you guys didn't really hear me or see both talking about the products is because I wasn't really too impressed by the majority of them there were a few that i really you know messed with but i'm going to mention a shampoo from them it's their green drink vitality spring back adjustment recovery shampoo 
amazing papaya and virgin egyptian honey reconstruct curly hair recover damaged hair their products are a mouthful let me catch myself and it's mostly made of natural ingredients so if you're looking for a natural shampoo that is moisturizing cleanses your hair you should try this out i haven't used it in a while but for the beginning of the year i use this a lot and it's also almost finished. I know for us natural girls, we usually don't finish shampoos, but we finish shampoos in this household. I love finishing shampoos. I get a rush of endorphins when I finish shampoos. <laughs> so if you're sitting there waiting for the next selection to be conditioners, I don't really care for conditioners what I do but mostly deep conditioners and I do have a deep conditioner hunt series I did create a playlist and added them all in there so what I'm thinking to do is when I reach at least 10 I can talk about my top three or maybe when I reach about 20 I can talk about my top eight or five help me out like what do you guys think I should do I'm going to jump right into leaving conditioners i only have one leaving conditioner to mention to you guys <laughs> lately i have not been using leave-in conditioners like that because my moisturizers are so bomb that i don't find the need to add any extra product sometimes the leave-in conditioner that i'm going to mention to you is by alley Kay naturals and it's their lemongrass leave-in conditioner you guys know that this is a fave from how long ago years i don't think i've tried a leave-in conditioner that comes even close to to this the way it makes my hair feel the moisture just whoa this I can use it to do my washing goals. I can use it to help moisturize my hair. I can use it under my gels, like to slick my hair. Like, huh, this? I know I put a lot of you on to this because a lot of you used it and you told me how bomb this has been for your hair. So if you have not tried it yet, I think you should. So we're going to move on to the meat of this video. We're going to talk about products that help moisturize your hair, keep your hair looking shiny, juicy, supple, plump. When it comes to moisturizers, I stick to the same thing over and over and over again. And these products have held me down real tight and me nah let go. First, we're going to talk about Trail, trail Lux Loops. Trillu, I don't know how you pronounce this. Trillux, Trillux, Trillux. The, one of the above. <laughs> They're Curl Supreme 4 in 1 Hydrating Cream. Hydrate, strengthen, protect, and style. And I've worked with them before, and that's how I actually got to try this product. This hair is super moisturizing and it's mostly natural mostly natural products are what i my hair really loves but you just never know until you try this this creates lustrous moisturized and defined curls with a soft hole correct no lies i love using this under my gels for my wash and go and you guys know i don't really do wash and goes that often but when i do if i know i want a bomb wash and go <laughs> This is the way to go, especially under any kind of gel, under echo, under wet line. I haven't tried. Listen, y'all know how I feel about washing goods. We're not gonna talk about that right now. But this bomb, get on it. Next we have curls in the building, like literally. We're gonna talk about curls, blueberry bliss, twist and shout cream. A lot of you probably know about this. A lot of you have probably tried this before. So you know what's up. You know what's going on. She is moisturizing. She is very moisturizing, actually. I just hate the fact that it's, like, so expensive. But the majority of the products that I spoke about in this video are expensive. I guess I just have expensive taste when it comes to my hair. But not on purpose. I just love quality products that do what they said they were going to do in the first place. Um, this can be used for twist outs, braid outs. I actually tried this under a gel for my washing goes and it was bomb as well. At this point, 
I feel like I need my own collection with Ali K Naturals because they just have been doing it for me. The love I have for these products are real. The people around me have love for these products as well. I just feel like they're so underrated. Well, a lot of people say that they're, they're expensive. You guys have seen me use this on my channel so many times. It's the Ali K Naturals Lemongrass Super Twisted Butter. Y'all have about five, five of these. It's ridiculous. The love for this is ridiculous because this holds me down. This has held me down for the year. This has, this has been paid. This has been husband. This has been my confidant. This has been my ride or die. This has been, this has been it. This is super moisturizing. This ha also has hold. This gives me definition. This is my favorite product of the year. When I told you guys that sometimes I just jump straight into moisturizing. Y'all, I feel like this has conditioning properties, leave-in conditioner properties, deep conditioner properties, like moisturizing properties, all in one. They really put their foot in this product. Like, I hope not because that would be very unsanitary. I'm gonna stop talking about it now because it's kind of getting weird. So, <laughs> next. Next on the list is another Ali K Naturals product and it's their Shea Yogurt Hair Moisturizer. Tell me why it's almost empty. You can't tell me, but I can tell you. So my mom, she just, she just, she finished it. <laughs> That's how bomb it is. Like if my mom is just coming into my room and just using my products, her hair doesn't really retain moisture that well. The products have to be really good for her hair. And she loves this, obviously, because it's almost done and I, I didn't even get the chance to use much of it. But if I'm not using the lemongrass twisted, twisting butter, I'm using this. Super, super moisturizing. It doesn't really give much hold. It's just add moisture into my hair no matter what. I know I can run back to it no matter what products I used previously. I know this is going to hold me down. Lastly, I have another product from Ali K Naturals and you guys are probably just tired of me at this point because we're just talking about Ali K, Ali K, Ali K, Ali K, Ali K, Ali K, Ali K Naturals. But Ali K Naturals is doing the thing for me and it did the thing for me in 2019 so we're going to talk about it and you're going to listen. So we have the Ali K Naturals Moisture Rich Hair Parfait. This is bomb on freshly wash hair i feel like i can actually try this as a moisturizer under my gels for a wash and go I, ha I haven't gotten around to trying it yet but that's what i used in my hair alone right after i washed my hair for a moisturizer it does have hold I haven't been using it as much as i used the previous products from alike naturals every time i use it i'm just so shocked and confused as to why i haven't been picking it up as often when i have a favorite product i just usually use that alone until it's finished and then i'll try something else you guys remember that big tub of olive oil eco styler gel that i had yeah it's finished and this is my favorite gel to use to slick down my hair and that's about it that's what i use it for i don't really like the other gels to slick down my hair so i usually reach for this all the time so i had to add it into the video these products are big if you didn't know now you know i'm so happy that i finally got to talk to you guys about them today i just feel so much better now like life has been made thank you guys for watching this video i hope you enjoyed see you in the next video bye